Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. A question I see a lot of people ask is, how do you record gameplay from your Steam Deck? If this is a question you have asked yourself, then today is your lucky day. I have two methods which I use of how to do this. The first is a quick and easy way using Decky Loader plugin. I have a video on the must have Decky Loader plugins that I'll link up in the top corner. And the second is a more advanced option involving OBS Studio, but using an external PC or Mac. Let's get started. Let's start with Decky Loader Plugin, a simple tool that lets you record directly on your Steam Deck without needing any external hardware or software. Here's how to set it up. First, you install Decky Loader by following the instructions on the official GitHub page. Once installed, you'll find a new icon on your quick access menu. They're the three little dots. From there, install a recording plugin like Replay Sorcery or Decky Recorder. I use Decky Recorder personally. Then while you're in game, you can open the quick access menu, they're the three little dots, navigate to the plugin and start recording. It's that easy and everything stays integrated right there within the Steam Deck interface. So what are the pros and cons of using Decky Loader? So Decky Loader's simplicity is a huge plus, especially if you want to start recording quickly. However, the recording quality and customization options are more limited compared to OBS. For quick and easy gameplay captures though, it's a fantastic option. Now for those of you who want more advanced features and flexibility, you can use OBS Studio on an external PC or Mac to record gameplay from your Steam Deck. Here's how to set it up. Start by connecting your Steam Deck to an external capture card. Devices like the Elgato HD60 Plus and Averbedia are great options. I personally use a Ugreen capture card I got off Amazon for like 15 quid. Plug the Steam Deck's output into the capture card which will then be connected to your PC or Mac via USB. I have mine permanently set up with a dock. If you'd like to see the video on how to set this up, please do let me know in the comments. Right, so once you've done all that, you go on your computer and you install OBS Studio, a powerful and free software for recording and streaming. Then you need to set up OBS by adding your capture card as a source, then configure your recording settings like your resolution, your frame rate, and where you want to save your files. Once everything is set up, you can start recording or even live streaming from your Steam Deck gameplay through OBS, all while your PC and Mac handles all the heavy lifting, so you don't lose any power on your, your Steam Deck. If you'd like me to set a video up to show you how to set up OBS, then please do let me know in the comments. So what are the pros and cons of using OBS? So using OBS with an external PC or Mac gives you significantly more control over your recordings. You can adjust quality settings, add overlays, and even use an external microphone or camera. However, this setup requires additional hardware like a capture card and a compa compatible computer, making it more complex and costly. But if you're aiming for high quality recordings or streaming, then this is the best option. So which method should you choose? If you're looking for simplicity and convenience, the Decky Loader plugin is perfect, absolutely flawless. But if you're after professional quality recordings, or streaming in fact, and you have an external PC or a Mac with a capture card, then OBS Studio is your best bet. Choose the method that fits your needs and start capturing your best Steam Deck moments today. If this video has helped you out, don't forget to like and subscribe for more Steam Deck tips and tricks. Thanks for watching, and happy gaming!